Hey everybody, I'm Crow, and welcome back to Paper Mario, the Origami King. Wow, you dig up some kind of strange rock, what is it? Hmm, it's quite old, it might be an ancient treasure. Or a simple ancient rock. Either way, I advise that you hang on to it. Diamond Jewel. So basically, I went up top and the mural thing said, like, something along the lines of, if you want to find my jewel, it'll be quite a feat unless you check by my feet or something. And then there was a little marker right here. So I dug here and that's where the jewel was. So I should just be able to throw the thingy do and the who's a what's it. And then we profit. Oh, it fits perfectly. How cute. Oh, the stone you put in there is sparkly. So bright. What's happening? Other than this pretty light show. It's a fire and it's lasers. Light amplification by stimulated... Emission of radiation. That one. I always lose it in the middle. Back. What was all that shaking? How did we all fall down? What just happened? Why did you fall down, Olivia? You weren't even touching the ground. Ball. It was actually just right here. Triangle Jewel. A triangular gem that was protected by two cacti. I didn't even read the thing yet, but I saw this earlier when I came to this area, and I was like, dude, this looks super suspicious. Olivia, you burned up. Amazing. They didn't teach this in school. And I minored in regenerative immolation. Wow, I really lit this place up. Oh my gosh, I set all that black water on fire. Now it's bright in here. Wow, good lighting sure makes a difference. Oh, I, I bet it was too dark to even read that inscription before. Doing things out of order. Check. This thing gonna be open in no time. So this first one should be over here, where you can no longer see the thing you do. Yep. Brown jewel. So that's for the western one. Man. That one was by far the hardest. So the walls of waves, I guess, is this stuff right above the door. This was the only place with fireplaces. This was actually the last one I got. The other ones had a lot of money in them, so that was pretty cool. That's why we got lots of money. It's because of the other fireplaces. But, uh... Yeah, apparently this is walls of waves, even though it's just this tiny little bit right here. That actually took quite a while. Rounding up all these pieces. The last one. The last one was pretty tough, actually. Oh, I thought it looked like Pac-Man when there was only three of them. It's actually just the Earth Elemental thing. That makes sense. Wait, I don't need to fall down, do I? I'm floating. Oh, no pom-poms this time. Temple of Shrooms. Goodness, this must be the Temple of Shrooms itself. So this is what it meant by desert sand and tombs. Ah, the Ancient Ones did love a good cryptic hint. Yes? Hmm, yes, it seems that this may be the final resting place of the Ancient King Shroomsies. I've also discovered that a sort of safety mechanism was responsible for burying the temple in the sand. When the sun went out, the temple retreated into the earth for safekeeping. Oh, so the temple wasn't taking a nap or something. Uh, no, it's a king's temple, so it was designed this way to ward off intruders, interlopers, infidels, and er, 
unauthorized visitors. In any case, we should be quite careful as we explore. This temple is almost certainly rigged with traps. Look at that. Speeder webs. I gotta fix it. I don't know if we can fix the spider webs, but I can fix everything else. Oh, I can't instantly defeat them. Oh, I can't by jumping them off. It's just like those things in... Where Zelda was that? Was that Twilight Princess? I think it was Twilight Princess. I remember it being a good one. Might be, might be Wind Waker as well. Are there little bug things that jump on you? I think it was Twilight Princess. Professor's actually pretty good. He hits more often than Bobby did. And he can hit two targets instead of just one. Why is there not an extra sconce here? There's secrets and it has something to do with the missing sconce, I can tell. Shiny Shroom, you don't say. This will very much be stairs when this falls out. There it is. Looks like derp. I have a toad with me that can dig. Of course this sand is relevant. I'm over here jumping up and down and like hammering this stuff. Can literally dig. Get bushed on. Let me just double check. There was no sand over here, yes? Okay. There was items in the other stuff. In fact, is there random things out here? I mean, I'll take the money. Nothing feels bad, though. Free weapons. Nah, we got a bunch of stuff. This room was cool. I'll stand on this one, you stand on that one. Or no, does it need the weight of both of us? Ah, this one is very complex. The grammar is of an ancient type, even for ancient writing. Goodness, even the interrobangs have been reversed. This will take me some time, I'm afraid. I understand now. We really just needed to hit both of them. I was actually sitting there for a little bit. Not too long, thankfully. Can you keep that racket down while I'm translating? Now, where was I? Whoa, when did that happen? To be honest, I could spend a few more hours on the left set of text, but I suppose this isn't the right time. Very well, onward. I can't see. It's quite dark in here, even for an ancient temple. As a scholar and a scientist, I don't believe in ghosts or similar nonsense, but I don't like this feeling. I'm impressed you came in here. Show yourself, ghoul. This toad has a weapon. Ah, it was my own shadow. Ah, this isn't good. I'ma hit him. I'ma hit all of them. The secrets, we're gonna get them. Okay, tell me you saw that. Was it a strange shadow? You can't, you can't just tell me it's my own imagination. Lol. Just because I was happening to hit all of them. Was it something? Tell me it was nothing. I must make it out of here to publish my findings. Are there toads in here? There should not be any toads in here, right? Absolutely. Oh, there are toads. How is that even possible? This thing's been buried for how many bajillions of years? Mommy Goombas. That's okay, they're just Goombas at the end of the day. Huh, I guess that's not a thing. Maybe later. And look at how easily defeatable these mummies are, though. They basically just get one extra hit. And look, they're refilling our confetti. Desperately needed resources. Whoa, look out for all those holes. Be careful, Mario. Oh, 
I wonder what would have happened if we fell into the holes. Did we just take damage? Or was there secrets down there? Instantly defeated. Instantly defeated. It's actually pretty big damage. I'm curious, what could possibly be attracting the attention of that many spiders? Oh, there's a pair of twitching toad feet in the middle of those spiders. Not well, time to look at literally everything else in the room. Oh, there's a Triforce. And a triangle. And an hourglass. And another Triforce. But that wasn't the correct pattern. Won't you help, Mario? Ah, you always you always making me do the good things. You obliterated. Oh, you poor thing. Are you all right? Nope. Is this Toad not all right? Everything looks normal from here. Toad, did something happen to your face? Toad's face is gone. Toad's face is gone. Toad's face is gone. Is gone. Toad's face gone. Face Toad is... Toad's face, it's just not there. Oh, I hope it doesn't hurt. I think the Toad is trying to talk to us. Toad, can you hear me? You still have ears somewhere in your head. Or would we call it? Or is it a hat? Anyway, say something. Obviously they're hats. Ah, I guess no face means no mouth. Now, who would do this to a poor Toad for no reason? Personal internment number. One, four, two, three. That wasn't that bad, and that actually had booze. Whoa, loads of extra money. Get destroyed it. Professor Toad coming in clutch. There were two that survived because I messed up the placement because booze are really hard. Didn't matter because he killed the two that I didn't. Fire of Elemental Statue. There's light over here, obviously this goes up. So all we got was a ton of money and treasure. Oh, another toad. Oh, mega derp. Oh my god, I just figured it out. One, four, two, three. It's based on the number of triangles. That's one triangle. Three. Four. Two, three? Was it two, three? Yeah, it was two, three. I second guess myself too much. One triangle, four triangles, two triangles, three triangles. The pipe was blocked, by the way. So that green pipe was not an option. Are we fighting a hole puncher or what? Why are they all missing perfect circles? Hmm? What? Eek, what's all that? I'm an archaeologist, not an ar arachnologist, but it seems to be a massive spider web. Well, I don't like the looks of it at all, those poor toads. Unfortunately, I don't think we can help them from here. Maybe we can get below them somehow. Okay. Get instantly defeated. If I know they're all gonna break, then it's not even a thing. Give me CD. Deep, deep vibes. Oh, that's not creepy at all. Watch this have to be done in a specific way. A star lights your way. Where here is there a star? Up oh, here it is. Got it. Well, what? Well, this is fun. 
I don't know what's happening, but my hips suddenly started shaking by themselves. I'm at a loss for words. This is unlike anything I've ever seen in my study of the antiquities. And that crown jewel in the center of the ceiling is simply stunning. I wonder what's inside. Dare I say it belongs. Sorry to interrupt, Professor. But there's the streamer. Belongs in a museum. It looks like it's going into that door, doesn't it? Hey, DJ. You call that music? I call it a racket. Stop scratching around and put on something I can dance to. If I ain't moving to the groove when the needle drops, I'm gonna collect your face like a limited edition 7-inch single. Yo, 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 don't do that. I'll cue up something groovy with the quickness, my man. All right, you've got to save me. This guy is such a weirdo. He keeps asking for groovy music to cut a rug do. Do I look like I'm 100 years old? I'm a DJ, man. I have no idea what that means. My face is at stake here. Y'all, my face. You gotta help. No, not your face. That's where you put your sunglasses. Anyway, what's wrong with the song you were just playing? I happen to think it was quite, quite groovy. I don't know. This guy's taste in music makes no sense to me. But he is very opinionated. He doesn't like any of the music that I put on. And he won't come out of that room. Anyway, here's how you can help. I dropped some of my sound discs on the way here. Maybe one of those discs has a tune this guy will actually like. I'll try you to buy some time while you're look while you're looking. Just get those discs and bring them back to me. There are four of them, yo. Oh, whoever in that room is the one taking all those poor toads faces. So we've got to get him out of that room and somehow reface those toads. What kind of music is the groovy is groovy enough to get him out of there? It's probably going to end up being one of the last ones we get. I mean, I suppose I haven't tried the other two, but I don't know why they would be the ones from the beginning. We probably had just have to get all of them. Speed or no speeding? I don't think you're strong enough to open it by yourself, and I haven't much strength to offer either. Look at how absolutely, like, turned this wall is. Look at these markings, almost as if something was dragged across the floor here. Oh, this needs to go back, derp. Okay. To wake the moon and make a run, the power of ten must push as one. It's left by three above the sun. You got me. Did you hear that? It sounded like someone said WAP, which is the ancient word for I've got you now, mustache boy. We must be vigilant. Oh, it doesn't let me do anything. That's why. Also, totally have to push this over. I could see the thingy from the ground. Let's do the thousandfold of thingy thing and then grab the thing thing, though. Thrills at night. That's probably the one. Yeah, that's right. You just be disappointed in there. Alright. This one goes out to all the terrifying monsters in the house. Let's get into it. That's pretty groovy. Now that's groovy! Ah, oh, that bass line is making my body do things I never dreamed possible. I'm ready to get down. Wait, wait, wait. I'm not going to be the only one down there getting loose. Why is this place so dead? Who killed the mood? I'm not going to cut a rug unless everyone is cutting a rug. Dig? Well, at least he likes his song, but we've got to do something about the dance floor. Normally, filling the dance floor is my specialty, but this clown won't let me play my jams. Wait, maybe we can get those faceless toads to help. They'll dance to anything, right? Here, take this ancient portable music machine. It's already got a disc inside, so just walk around bumping it. And I know those faceless toads will follow. We need about 40, I'd say. Good luck. That was very much not it. Could it be behind the heart one? Could this be a heart? It was. Max heart up plus 10. Okay, well, anyway, over by three and up by one. 
I do believe means that it's in that moon one, of course. Why oh, is it a different color? Nope, that's fine. I fought everything except for that one scuttlebug. We actually fought the other ones, too. So now that this room is clear... You've done it. You're a natural-born archaeologist, Mario. Got all the other toads from all the previous areas as well. I don't remember if we mentioned that. This has been going on for a long time. Ah, jeez. Yo. I know a bunch of scuttlebugs. About to get wrecked. Fantastic. I'm gonna get them all down. Hmm, so the spider webs were actually just from spiders. That's kind of interesting. It actually makes you go with the flow. Come on, guys. At least some of these nine over here. We got him. Hey, you did it. You got enough toads to set this party off. Let's get him on the dance floor and see what happens. Yo, 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 it's DJ Toad bringing you the, uh, well, not the latest hits, but it's music. Get out on the dance floor with those faceless freaks and our special guest, Mario. I always believed in Mario's ability to disco. Whoa. I dig it. Oh, yeah. It's groovy. The Disco Devil. It is a hole puncher. And I know you're in the groove and all, but you totally blew all the toads off the stage. And you punched out their faces earlier. Did you do that just so you, they would dance with you? That's so monstrous. Lady, I couldn't stop grooving now if I wanted to. So I guess we're going to have to face off. I am pumped. I'm gonna own this dance floor till the break of dawn. And seeing as there's no sun to rise in here, that means this groove is never gonna end. Hey, come on. I'll start with some moves even amateurs can appreciate. Ooh, come on, one-two punch. Okay, I have to hand it to this thing. Its dance moves are pretty sharp. They were so sharp that they left holes on the floor. I'm guessing we should steer clear of those. There's actually holes in the on switch. I wonder if that means it's not an on switch. If it's not an on switch, then we have no way of doing anything other than attacking. So let's try and just attack. And I will get us items. And we'll take a hint. Yep, it didn't work. 
The hole punch's yellow body is really tight. Tough. He's hiding a vulnerable spot somewhere. It's probably the black part on the back then. Oh my god, I didn't equip more weapons. We hammering it out this time, because I've only got, like, about to break flashy iron boots. Lid handle. It actually says different parts of the body. At least we got our flashy hammer. Twenty-seven, get boosted. You wanna dance? You wanna dance, bro? Let me show you what you what you're up against. Hop one, two, alright. Oh my god, max health 85? Mario, your face! No! Never mind. Look, just give me the big damages. Wow, even our damage is down. Get blocked on. Is it time for me to bust out my super secret special dance move? Let's hear it. Make some noise. What is that? Is that a face? Wait, Mario, that's you. Your punched out face is stuck on the dance floor. You better grab it quick. The whole puncher's charge attack is a brutal body slam. Seek higher ground to avoid heavy damage. Yep, this was the right move then. It's on. We got our face back. And we have Earth Elemental Power. So this should ook him in the duker. And then get us to high ground. Looking good, Olivia. Only five damage. I guess this was mostly just for the not dying then. No way, you dodged my special move. Get back down here so I can two-step on your face. Let's do a big damage. Boom! 48. Oh, wow. Whole punch has fallen. It can't move. I get another one? Oh, no. Money, money, money. The two times damage up for next time. And the flashy hammer. Come on. Dude, we're getting them. One more hit. Man, I guarded and everything. More bonus stuff and earth elemental. We're dodging the attack just in case. I don't want to find out that they're invincible while they're in this move. This will still do some damage, and if not, we can quickly end it. Just give me the five damage, Olivia. And get me to safety. Boom. That means it's got like eight health left. Huh, look at how vulnerable you are. I kind of just want the money at this point, because this is, this is beyond over. And then our last use of the boots. Boop, 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 boop. That was the easiest boss we fought. Like, I honestly feel like that was easier than the colored pencils. Aw, oh, man, why'd you have to harsh my groove? We had it bumping in here. Let's keep it going anyway. Disco forever. Count it down. Three, two, one... And all of the toads get saved.
gonna wreck it. Three is five streamers down. 60% completion. Purple and green look great next to each other. Oh, the sun was in the disco ball. The actual sun was in the disco ball. And now it's a desert again. Congratulations, yellow streamer cleared. It dunked on. I want to go to the water place. Max confetti increased. It's getting to be as big as Mario. Look at this, you two. The altar has opened up to reveal some kind of entrance. This may contain what I've been seeking. Proof of the ancient ones themselves. Yes, it all makes sense now. You performed the ceremony with the sun incense, but the sun itself was missing. Now that it is returned, the path inside has revealed itself. Oh ho, wait until they hear about this back at the university. I expect registration for my spring semester courses will be at an all-time high. I'm not sure what the professor's talking about, but I'm glad he's so happy. Ah, oh, well, it's all thanks to you two, of course. This may have remained sealed forever if you hadn't been able to return the sun to the sky. Now then, let's hurry inside. I'm certain we'll find even more to celebrate, perhaps even a solid lead on the legendary Captain Teod himself. Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you liked it. Later, everybody.